Okay, so we're back where we started in the slumbering wield. Um, I wonder... So we are gonna fight, we're gonna find, I guess this is where we're gonna find the legendary soon, which is super fun. We can catch some Pokemon here while we're here with uh, Quick Falls, like a Hootoot. Why not? Let's catch him. This is a good thing about having Quick Balls, or we could use a Level Ball, because... Um, where's my Quick Ball? Okay. This will probably catch him instantly. Super excited to see what's going to happen with the darkest day. I'm a little worried it's going to be underwhelming though. I want to see like Dynamax Pokemon just running havoc everywhere. But yeah, we got a Hutu. That's kind of lame. Um, well, it's not lame. It always stands on one foot. It changes feet so fast the movement can rarely be seen. Interesting. We'll send them to the box. Um, yeah, let's just keep going. We can come back and like catch every Pokemon later. Actually, we'll kill this guy because he will give us some watts. And why not? A wild squabbit. That was my dog, Copper. She's being cute. Um, we can use anything. I just want to get the watts. Bam, bam, bam. So overkill. <laughs> That's how it goes. You gotta do what you gotta do to get the watts in this game. 79 watts. That's not too bad. Okay, let's go and... He should be around here somewhere. Zac Zacian. Very excited to catch... Oh, what the hell? What are these guys doing here? A wild wheezing. So it's still called wheezing, but it's like... Is it going to be level 3? Level 45, okay. Cool. We've got to get one of these, they just look really wacky. Um, we should have used a... Okay, use some strut, go to it. What a dummy. Why would you do that? I wanted to catch you. Imagine if we see a shiny one. That would really not be funny though, because he's self-destruct, we'd lose him. Alright, let's try catching this guy with a quick ball. That's probably the only way we can really catch it. Unless we get a... you need to get like a Pokemon with damp, if you're going to shiny hunt this. Alright, let's use a quick ball and just hope for the best. Was that a critical throw? Um, don't toxic me, you jerk. I think I'll just... He's gonna self-destruct though, so I don't know what to do. Let's run away. Oh wait, no, I should have killed it because that one had watts. Oh well. Oh look, it's a Muna. I love those ones. Alright. Full restore. I should probably use a poison heal. I think we had one right up here. Oh, it's called an antidote, isn't it? I guess I don't have one. Oh well, we'll just U-turn when we join every fight. Loads of cool Pokemon here. Let's just keep going. As an item. Mental herb. It can only be used once, so I'm not going to use it. Alright. Whoa, a Corviknight. Loads of cool Pokemon along here, but we'll have to come back. Because I'm really eager to see the legendary. Smoke Ball. That could be useful, I guess. What's that? It's one of these. Stunfisk. I don't want to fight him though. 
Let's run away. We're gonna go straight to the legendary. Okay. Pop is probably gonna heal me, because he's a good boy. This looks like the place where the hobbits go. What's with this fog? It's even worse than the first time we came here. It is. Oh look, there he is. And he's brought his friend, the shield one. They were just in here the whole time. They really are here, the sword and shield Pokemon, I knew it. It's kind of, you know, anticlimactic. They're just kind of standing there. Oh, they're gone, okay. Hey, where are you going? We need your help over here. You two, what in the world are you doing? What? Come off it, Sonia. You must have seen that, right? Those sword and shield Pokemon, they were right in front of us. But then they disappeared into the forest. Hop, you sure you haven't lost the plot? There was no one here but you, the two of you. What? Then were those just illusions or something? Listen, I dug into some literature from other reasons and I finally found something. Mentions of the sword Pokemonization and a shield Pokemon called Zamazenta. The writing said that those two Pokemon were born somewhere beyond the slumbering wield sometime long, long ago. Did they really? Ta, Sonia, thanks for digging into it. Even if it's just an illusion or whatever, we did manage to find that Pokemon again. Maybe the sword and shield that those two used to carry are still here too. Yes, we've got to go look for it. Heal me please, actually, while I'm here. Never mind. Um, I just want to go straight, I want to continue the story. No time for fishing. Ooh, a cutscene. Oh, this looks fancy. Wow. Looks like, really looks like Zelda. Would you take a look at that, Jake? Now that's something you don't see every day. This place definitely feels like the stuff of legend of Zelda. Is it just going to be right here? The sword and shield. Oh, I've seen that somewhere before. Oh my god, the sword and shield is here, but it's all broke. It'll probably still be worth a lot, though. For museums. See that, Jake? The sword and the shield. The legends really were true. Wow. You obtained a rusted sword. Said that a hero used a sword to hold a terrible disaster in ancient times, but it's grown rusty and worn. That settles it. I'm taking the shield. Though, wow, would you look at the state of this thing? It seems like it might fall to pieces if you so much as look at it funny. I don't know if these rusty old things will really be able to stop the darkest day, but... Well, I guess it can't hurt to have them along. Let's hope they bring us some good luck. Okay. Maybe the Pokemon themselves really are still asleep somewhere. So it seems we're on our own if we want to go help Lee. This is all the help we've got. Alright, so where do we go now? Okay, we've got to go to... Yeah, let's go. Go straight to Hammerlock. Damn, I wanted to see more of the forest. Right hands here. Well, if it isn't Jake and Hop, it's a real shame the way things have turned out. You make it all the way to the championship match, then something like this has to happen. And Chairman Rose thinking that the energy pouring from the darkest day would somehow be the key to saving Gala's future. All seems a bit mad if you ask me. I can't follow it at all how that's supposed to work. Well, I don't care if I'm up against the darkest day or the chairman or whatever. I'm going ahead. I'm off to help my brother. And he's gone. That hop never changes. Always in a rush about something, isn't he? The key thing is that no one's harmed. We gym leaders work together with the city's Pokemon, and now we've got everyone evacuated. And you, you're fixed in to help our champion to save everyone in the Gala region? Of course I am. Our greatest ever champion and the greatest ever challenger, along with his fiercest rival, 
all teaming up against the Darkest Day. I almost feel sorry for it. Go on then, our great challenger, into Hamlock Stadium with you. But first I need to go heal. Oh, actually, I should go check all the poke jobs as well. I bet there's some... Yeah, there's... I thought they evacuated the town. It's still full. Oh my god, they really don't seem bothered at all. They could have had it like just the Rotoms token over the poker center for a while. They literally just said they've evacuated the whole thing. <laughs> kind of silly. Okay, let's go. Whoops. Actually, we can do the Lotto as well, I think. Unless we did it yesterday. Lotto ID. Ah, oh, we've already done it. Check poker jobs. Oh, we got none. Okay. Never mind, we got nothing new. Okay, let's go. Uh oh, Olina and someone else. And Sonia, is that? No, it's not. Jim Challenger, you must help me. I mean, please help me. My Pokemon suddenly Dynamax for some reason and started running amok in the stadium. Raihan, I mean, Mr. Raihan was able to subdue the Dynamax Pokemon in the stadium, but. If other Pokemon almost dynama also Dynamax and go on a rampage, the underground power plant would collapse. Mr. Rose is down there right now. I know this is selfish of me, but I must beg for your assistance. I want to head to the underground power plant and stop Mr. Rose. Mr. Rose has awakened a Pokemon known as Eternatus. Oh my god. Apparently the energy emitted from its body is what causes Dynamaxing. At this rate, all the Pokemon in the Galar region will Dynamax and go berserk. If that were to happen, please, you must save Mr. Rose. You can take the lift over there to reach him. I've enlisted the help of the champion's younger brother too, but who knows what's going on. Wow, so this is... I didn't... I... This is exciting. I know nothing about Eternus. I'm so excited. Wait, where are we going? Down in here? I guess we are. Yeah. Okay, we're going down into a power plant. Another staple of a Pokemon game. Always an energy plant in there. Wow, this looks like really intense. Where does this go though? <laughs> okay, hops here. What is going on? What what is all this? We need to help Lee. This is so exciting. And what do you plan on doing, Jim Challenger? Um, stopping the darkest day. Uh, pardon? What are you talking about? There's nothing to stop now. We've already brought about the darkest day. Or should I say, the ultimate Pokemon, Eternatus. Must I explain myself? From your perspective, I suppose it must seem that I'm doing something terrible. I don't expect you to understand, but I must provide the Gala region with limitless energy to ensure everlasting prosperity. It is my purpose, my duty, my destiny. That's why we've been giving the wishing stars to Eternatus. Surely you remember the red light that caused a ruckus around Hamelock. That was all part of our experiment to awaken Eternatus. You must understand, I can't let you interfere with my plan to protect the future of Gala. Damn. Wow, it's all... This must be the real big bad guy. As Gavalier. That's a bug type. Okay, what we're gonna do is U turn and switch to Bear Tick, I think. Oh, we can Dynamax down here. We'll switch to Bear Tick because he will definitely be able to kill it. You're pretty tough, yes, entirely too tough. Don't you think that's un unfair? No. I should probably have taught Bear Tick some better moves. Mega Horn. Ooh, wow. That was powerful. Hopefully this kills it. Oh, what? Damn! 
This is harder than I thought it would be. Let's switch to... What moves did he have? Iron Head... And something else. Um... We should be good. I don't think he can hurt me. Let's use Shadow Ball a bunch. Alright, once... Sword Stance, yeah. I think we... This is really a cheese strat, but it's so fun. Shadow Ball him until he dies. He hit really hard. Killed Bear Tick. I guess Bear Tick isn't really that good, but still, he should be should have been better than that. Boom. What is all this stuff? I guess it's all like energy stuff. This is so cool. I really wonder what Eternus is going to look like. Eternatus. I've enjoyed this game a lot. Like, way more than I thought I would. So I thought it was going to suck, and it didn't. Okay, Spite. Um, that's no, no use. Not useful for me, anyway. Perserker. Actually, I think it won't have any moves that can kill us either. Actually, it's probably going to have a dark move, but... We can dig. And then we can see what move it uses. Shadow Claw. Yeah, it can kill us. Oh well. Shedinja's going to die after this. Throat Chop. Never mind. Wow, we actually... Shedinja's going to sweep his team. Probably not, but still. It would be cool if it did. <laughs> Berserker's down. And I just noticed the bad guy has a, um, like, Galarian Persian. Pling Clang. Doesn't seem like he'd have something that can kill me. Maybe I will sweep his, sweep his team. Assurance. Damn it. It's going so well. Why would he have a move like that? Okay. Um. We need Bear Tick back. Oh well. He has Assurance, so he's dark. Um, let's use Barrascooter. I liquidate, liquidize. If it flinches, nah. Would have been good if he flinched. I think this increases speed and attack. Yes, yeah, speed rose sharply and attack rose. Wild charge. Oh no! Damn. But it damaged him a bunch. So let's use... Um, I think we should be good to use Toxtrazy with Overdrive. Here we go. Assurance. Oh, that was a crit. That was mean. Phew. I think I might have to break out the revives again. Okay. Ferrothorn. Um that's electric type, so and it's grass, so I think or is it steel? If it's steel this won't work. Oh damn it is steel. 
I guess it's steel and um, gra uh, steel and grass. Overdrive can or boom, but yeah, overdrive because. Not very effective. So steel and grass, what can work against him? Let's see. Let's swagger him. It'd be good. Hopefully he hurts himself. It's all he has to hurt himself. Else this is all for nothing. Haha, <laughs> good. Okay, and now play rough. Not effective, what? Why not? Iron barbs hurt me. Darn. Gyro ball. Um Damn! Damn it, darn it. Dang it. Okay. Gorilla Boom should be able to put up a good fight. But I should probably max revive Toxtricity. Or we should be okay to use. Um, Knockoff. Because then if it hurts itself, it'll be done. Please hurt yourself, you need to hurt yourself. Oh no. I think all that does is lower its speed. Uh, okay. Well, you could have done something else and you would have been good, but now you've done that. So well done, you played yourself. Okay. Depending on what he uses, Depends on who I max revive, I guess. Oh, down to my last Pokemon. Hmm, this isn't looking too good. Copperaja. Ooh, that's gonna be a tough Dynamax, I bet. What type is it, though? I don't know. It's gonna be a giant elephant. Big monkey. Okay. He's gonna gigantamax I bet. I'll show you a move that will hit you so hard you'll be speechless. I'm scared. Whoa. Why are so many Pokemon in this, like, all square? I hope this is super effective. I can't remember what type of Pokemon I draw is. Oh, no. That is not good. Alright then, hopefully this move will turn things around for me. Oh, no. Steel Surge. Oh, no. Okay, we should be able to tank one more hit of this, I think. Okay, let's use... If it's steel, then Bug won't be doing any good. I guess we'll have to max, max darkness. Okay, this is intense. Now we sh we have to we have to use a max restore, else we're gonna lose. Max revive. Who should we use it on? 
Um, is steel strong against ice, or is ice strong against steel? I guess I'll find out. But at least he's going to turn small. And I will revive Shedinja just in case things don't work out well. Or I could use superpower. Oh damn, he does a lot of damage. No, Shedinja will just die instantly. What should I do? Let's normal revive. Rillaboom, because he can tank a hit or two. Iron Head. Yeah, I knew that would happen. I knew Steel was strong against Ice. Okay. What can I do? I'm really stuck here. I guess I'll have to... I'm gonna have to use another Max Restore. Max Revive. On Barris Scooter. Heavy Slam. Damn it. Okay, all I need to do is... Oh god. Hopefully I can make him flinch. Let's use liquidation. Please flinch. Oh. If we can just survive this one attack, he's down. Okay, okay, this is good, this is good. We did it! Yes! That was close. We did it. I'm so glad. We defeated Marco Cosmos' Rose. Clap, clap, clap. I'd forgotten how great Pokemon battles are. It's been so long since I battled. That sure was satisfying. Oh, is he suddenly a good guy now? Probably not. Most impressive, Jake. I wouldn't expect any less from a challenger endorsed by the strongest champion ever to grace our beloved Galar region. I really do wish I could have seen a championship match between you two. And I'm terribly sorry to have ruined the whole gym challenge and everything. He's lying. It's too bad, but it can't be helped. In order to solve the energy issue as soon as possible, we, awaken, we awakened at Eternatus, but we couldn't control it. The champion came to aid me, even at the cost of abandoning the match. Indeed, just like a knight in shining armor coming to rescue a princess from a dragon. I do tend to ramble on, I know. I love to make speeches, but I think I can stop talking now. Could he be any more cliché? I think the champion should have captured Eternatus by now. If you're curious, you can take the lift up. And I trust you'll be going too, right, Hop? I certainly hope losing to me didn't discourage you too much. Go on now, both of you. Go see how our champion is doing. Discouraged? You don't get it, do you, Chairman? Neither me nor my Pokémon are anywhere near giving up. We've learned how to be strong thanks to the gym challenge you organized. Wow. So what, I bet there's another twist where Leon's a bad guy after all. But we'll have to wait and see. Thanks for watching this episode.